I recently did a jewelry vlog with uh, Sauce Walker. And, oh. Yeah, and now that shit went crazy, like 400,000 views. But everybody's telling me to do a jewelry vlog with you. Okay, let's do it, man. You know, we got we got a few little pieces over here, man. A lot of these pieces is older than these dudes watching these blogs. Like, <laughs> this shit right here is from like 2000. That lock and that key. Okay. You see how the key got diamonds on both sides. Then they got that carrot in the middle. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like, that shit is from years ago. They got the lock, matching lock right there. The how much do you think the, uh, the lock and the key uh, was when you got it? Man, I don't even remember, bro. That shit was so long ago. <laughs> yeah, like, I was like early, like early 2000s. That so you can't even put an estimate on, you can't even estimate how much. I don't even remember, bro. That's like, crazy. that shit ain't got, it's nowhere near as expensive as some of his other shit. You know, that's definitely not the major pieces. And then, you know, we got the platinum. That's platinum right here. False life chain. And, uh, we got the uh, Jesus head, like this is my little, I let my son wear these, you know. Okay. The angel wings, the little initial, it's like something I gave my son when we, he was a kid. Uh, this, now we got the gold boss life, baby boss life chain. We got the star, you know what I'm saying? With the chunky diamonds, you know, we like big diamonds. That's what really show value. The little diamonds cool, right. but when you got them big diamonds, that's when you worth something, you know. This is a little Jesus head, angel. This right here is the chunky shit. Like this right here, you see how big that stone is in the middle? You know, you got big five carat solitaire stone. That one stone right there is molding a lot of niggas whole set up. How much uh, did you this, spend on that? that, that <laughs> one solitaire like this, like these earrings, these two eight carat earrings, these earrings alone are like 160,000. You know what I'm saying? Just them earrings, you know what I'm saying? So, this one here got the 10 carat stone in the middle, you know. With all big diamonds, all of the big diamonds, we got the two twin bracelets, you know. Big diamonds in there. You know, that's what we, we do the chunky. We got the solitaire, you see the big diamond stone mm -hmm. and the pinky ring. Now, are you getting all this from like TV Johnny, like nah. the, the Houston Jewelers, or? Nah, you I get all, most of my jewelry, all this hair, come from uh, Emmett. In Houston. Okay. Uh, I got a couple pieces, like small piece. This from Johnny. This from King Johnny. This from King Johnny. The small that one there. But everything we got over here, man, is all from Emmett. That's the only jeweler you know I've been going to. I'm from the north side, like I said. I've been going to them for years since I was a yeah. kid, you know. So that's the only dude I really rock with. So really, I like all of them, but you know, that's, that's mainly who I buy my jewelry from. This the white AP with the leather band, you know what I'm saying? Then we got the platinum masterpiece. That's a masterpiece, Roly, real Rolex diamonds in the masterpiece, that's platinum. So you know, that's about shit. We got the uh, yin yang ring, big stones in it, all the way around. You know, we got the iced out, bust down AP. This shit years old, all this shit is old as fuck, bro. Yeah. Like, okay. We got the Yacht Master Roly. We got the, the Bentley Brightland with the chunky diamonds on the on the back. You know what I'm saying? That's how you know it's the Bentley with the wheel on the back, not the regular version. That's gold. So how do you know what's really not? Cause I'm on fake watch busters and I'm like on Instagram <laughs> and I'm like, yo, yeah. they, they all look the same. Like, how do you know you're not getting finessed? I mean, I know jury. I mean, you gotta just know jury. A lot of people don't know. A lot of people wearing fake shit and they just don't know. Or shit that ain't even valuable. Like this got a big diamond in it. That's like my everyday shit. Mm -hmm. You know, we got the whole black thing over here, like the black AP. Yeah. You know, Panky Ring. I'd rarely wear that shit. Yeah. But you know, like. Which one is like your favorite piece? Like, which one would you, you know, go to the club with? Um, you know, travel. It depends with? on what it is, man. Mainly, I'm doing the small boss life chain. Like, that's my main thing. I usually that one or the white one. Because at the end of the day, I'm 36, bro. I don't really care about jewelry so much mm -hmm. no more. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's cool. If I'm rocking one of these, if I'm doing the boss life, I'm at a show. If yeah. I'm doing this shit here, both of these, it's my birthday. It's some. It's a special occasion, yeah. you know, to pull out all them diamonds. Like, that shit there, like, this one motherfucking chain is like $300,000 alone. Yeah. With the 10 carat stone and that, with the chain. You know, so it's like some, it ain't really nowhere to go to wear this shit. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Like, you don't just, 
every day out wearing out this jury. What are some ways, uh, how do you avoid, you know, from getting your, you know, your chain snatched? Man, I'm a solid nigga and we street niggas and niggas know that. Yeah. And we ain't playing that. I ain't never been robbed in my life, you know, and that's just what that is. Yeah. So you're against like tucking your chain in when you go to certain places or, you know, it just depends on the environment. I mean, nah, I don't never tuck my chain in, but I ain't gonna never be in no, no stupid environment though. I'm, I'm not gonna be in no place where I don't, you know, fuck with people. I don't know people or, you know, um, <clears throat> that's just some ratchet shit like that. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. It's at least not without a pistol, you know what I'm saying? So, you know, I'm gonna be right. If I'm in the wrong place, I'm gonna definitely have my heat. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And some real niggas with me that's gonna shoot too, so. Yeah, you know. So you spoke on like you sometimes you trade your jewelry in or you like get right. you know you give to get some uh like what was some something that you traded for you know in the previous uh years? Man, honestly, I haven't bought no jewelry. That's what I'm saying. Like I haven't bought shit in no years. Like and I mean in year the la latest shit I bought was this smile shit. Okay. This you know these little chains because a lot of this jewelry, man, is just probably 10 years old, bro. Like, the shit just old, you know what I'm saying? I've been just getting it over the years, but as far as trading in, I had, this was a pinky ring. This 10 karat stone was a pinky ring once before. I used to have a cross, the same size diamonds as the chain, mm -hmm. where it was double, two two uh two of these together. Right. And I fuck around and lost it in Vegas, man. It was, uh, it was a $50,000 cross. <clears throat> that's crazy Vegas, yeah. so if you had to estimate all of this i know you you know is a lot of this was bought years ago yeah if you had to estimate you know how much you spent on all this what would you say what would your number be i don't know bro i don't know how much i spent on this shit but it's definitely worth it's definitely worth over half a mil half a million for sure for sure just the earrings and this chain right here alone is half a mil so right. yeah you know like it's worth some Crazy. Well, do y'all got it? Y'all begged for it. Right now, I'm gonna show you. I'm gonna go get the. Uh, okay. I'm gonna go get the appraisal. <laughs> this right here is uh, the one chain with the ten carat yellow diamond stone. You know what I'm saying? 118 diamonds, 275. You know what I'm Damn, hold on. That's crazy. Yeah, it's real. Hmm. You know, we don't do the fake shit around here. <laughs> man, make sure you tell them to go get that American King installed right now. Okay. Yeah, man, so. BossLifeWorld.com, yeah, get them clothes too, man. We got the clothes shit going too. Okay, where can they follow you, right? Where can they, you know, the mixtapes? Yeah. Like, what, what platforms is it on? Oh yeah, follow me on um on Instagram. It's howglife101, H-O-G-G. L I F E 101 and um, on the uh, Twitter is Slim Thugger. On um, Snapchat is Slim Thugger. You know what I'm saying? But I'm mainly on the gram though. That's when you're going if you want to stay updated. On Facebook it's Slim Thugger too, I think. I don't, I don't really be on there a lot. But yeah, man, fuck with me.